What's up, it's your boy CJ Goodfella. Back with the boxing clinic, doing another video. And, uh, you know, it was revealed that uh, Manny Pacquiao may, may make a return, and top ranking CEO Bob Arum actually reserved, I think, a, you know, a venue in Las Vegas, I think, for October 15th, I believe it was. That's unusual, because usually Manny Pacquiao fights in November or April. Um, and, you know, the, the two leading candidates were, you know, one was thought to believe Floyd Mayweather, but we know Floyd Mayweather's not fighting in October. Um, another, uh, Bob Merrill said, was uh, uh, junior welterweight Terrence Crawford, WBO champion. Another was uh, Adrian Broner uh, coming off a win off of Ashley Theo Payne. And Michael Kahn's just totally dismissed Terrence Crawford. Um, saying that Crawford never was in the running for a Manny Pacquiao fight. And that's crazy, dude. You know, Freddie Rose said, you know, that they were willing to fight Crawford. That they picked Crawford. That Bob Aaron was protecting him. Now we all know that's definitely a lie. This is what happened when your team is not on one accord. Um, Pacquiao knew that Terrence Crawford had Floyd Mayweather S type skills that he didn't want to fight Terrence Crawford. They knew Terrence Crawford was all wrong for Manny Pacquiao. Um, and another thing could be that Adrian Broner is a bigger star in America and could pull more pay-per-view tickets than Terrence Crawford. That's also a good reason for Manny Pacquiao picking Broner. But Terrence Crawford, they didn't want to pass the, the torch to Terrence Crawford at all. Um, no wonder why Terrence Crawford has went on the beat saying that... Uh, He's not going to sit around and wait for Manny Pacquiao or Floyd Mayweather fight. Because these guys know that he is a serious threat. A switch hitter. A dude that's, you know, at times can be hit easy, but is very defensive, responsible. Um, when he wants to be counter, can get off first and very aggressive. And really can box, you know what I mean? And I think that's a huge threat to a guy like Manny Pacquiao. He doesn't want to face another mover boxer that can really threaten him. And, you know, beat him even though he's at the end of his career and really deciding if he wants to come back or not. He's not going to come back versus that young, hungry, uh, skilled lion. And he, this dude, Freddie Roach, be talking out his ass, man. I don't believe shit, shit he says, bro. After this, I definitely don't believe anything he says. Because these, these guys totally just, you know, made Crawford seem like he wasn't ready. Um, you know what, Manny Pacquiao didn't want to take on Crawford. And we know Crawford's going to... You know, have a good showing versus Victor Postal. Um, so this your boy CJ Goodfellow. We gone.